Watching a talented magician can be fun. Eagerly watching the illusion as it unfolds can be exciting. But not all illusions are fun, and falling for an imposter scam does not create the same sense of excitement. Knowing about this common type of scam and how it works is an important first step toward protecting yourself against them and others. Imposter scams can be tough to identify because the scammer's goal is to create fear and urgency about a false situation by posing as a trusted source. The scammer could be posing as a government official, your local police department, credit card company, or any other trusted organization when they contact you. They'll often say there's an emergency situation that requires you to provide them your sensitive information so that they may verify your identity or help you fix what's happened. The threat of this situation and the haste they create tricks their targets into giving out information. And that's all a scammer needs to continue to access your personal information. Remember that companies generally don't contact you to ask for your username or password. Don't answer phone calls from those you don't know. Never provide money or gift cards to someone you've not met in person. And don't provide your personal information or computer access to people you don't know. At First Source Bank, we're constantly on the lookout for these scams and ways to keep your financial information safe and secure. We're vigilant about security and have safeguards in place to protect your information. Fraud is costing businesses and individuals across the world over $5 trillion each year. And it's more important than ever to understand and protect yourself against fraud. Remember, we will never call you or send you an email asking for your password or personal information.